I've had therapists advise me to give up ideas of fame and fortune when I was 25 years old walking out of a treatment center for drug addiction. I had finally taken 29 days and not used drugs for the first time in nine years. 3,600 days I tried to quit drugs every day. I went off to this treatment center. I'm off of the drugs for 28 days. The insurance runs out. They boot me to the curb. On the way out, the therapist says, hey dude, give up all your ideas of writing books, being on stages, and dropping out of ceilings. I had my sister tell me, man, you gotta pull it in a little bit, man. My twin brother, Gary, hey dude, dude it's a little too much. It's scary, man, when you start freaking out. I was 28 years old, three years sober, no drugs in my body for three years. I'm selling cars, I'm moving Toyotas, and I'm getting good at it too. Like you come in and say, look, I got bad credit and I'm not buying today. I'm like, oh, shit. that's two cars. I'm gonna penalize you. I'm gonna penalize you for saying that bull Okay, okay. You got, bad, you got bad credit? That's perfect. At least you got some credit. See, I ain't positive. I'm there to get something. So, so Captain Ryan says to me, he's like, you're the most positive person I know. I said, dude, I'm not positive at all. I'm 10X. I get results, okay? I want to get the deal done. I want to make my kids proud of me. My kids aren't going to remember whether I was positive or not. They're going to remember whether daddy delivered the goodies or not. You understand? When you go to Whole Foods and they say, hey, that'll be $427 for three bags. And you're like, I got a good attitude. They'd be like, you need to get some 10X. You need to get some 10X and some money to go with your freaking attitude.